Welcome to Sex and Education. In this video, we will talk about gonorrhea, which is a common type of sexually transmitted disease, or STD. We will talk about the diseases this infection causes and the symptoms that come with them. For more information on how to lower the chance of getting gonorrhea, check for it and treat it. See our chlamydia and gonorrhea prevention, diagnosis, and treatment video. Gonorrhea is an infection caused by the bacteria Neisseria gonorrhea. It is spread from one person to another during vaginal, oral, or anal sex. It can then go to different parts of the body, including the cervix, which is the entrance to the uterus, the urethra, which is a tube in the penis or next to the vagina where urine comes out of, the rectum, which is the last part of the large intestine above the anus, and the throat. Many people who get gonorrhea don't have any symptoms. If symptoms do happen, the most common ones are pus draining from the vagina or penis, or pain when urinating. But whether symptoms happen or not, gonorrhea can still lead to other problems if not treated quickly. Gonorrhea can spread up the cervix and uterus and into the fallopian tubes, which are little tubes that connect the ovaries to the uterus. This causes something called pelvic inflammatory disease, or PID. PID can lead to pain in the abdomen or pelvis, which is the lower part of the abdomen, fever, and feeling sick. It can also cause scarring in these tubes and future problems getting pregnant. For more information about PID, see our pelvic inflammatory disease video. Gonorrhea can also travel from the penis upward to something called the epididymis, which is a collection of tubes in the scrotum through which sperm travel. This can cause the testicles to swell and hurt. It can also lead to problems with making a baby in the future. Gonorrhea can infect the rectum and lead to pain, constipation, discharge, or the feeling of needing to go to the bathroom. It can also go to other parts of the body. For example, in some people, it can go to joints like the knees, ankles, and elbows and cause pain and swelling. Sometimes, a rash and pain along tendons, which are the places where muscles connect to bone, can also happen. For those who are pregnant during a gonorrhea infection, the infection can be passed down to the baby during birth. This can lead to a very bad eye infection and possible blindness in the baby. Sometimes, the infection can even spread to other parts of the baby's body and make the baby sick. Because gonorrhea can cause all of these health problems, it's important to try to keep it from happening and treat it early if and when it does happen. For more information about this, see our follow-up video called Chlamydia and Gonorrhea Prevention, Diagnosis, and Treatment. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get notifications about our latest videos.